Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Well, as you can see, I chopped my hair off. It is just, I have a blunt bob now. So yeah, I chopped my hair off. Just kind of wanted to explain why I did it, what motivated me to make this like huge change. Also, I'm just gonna show you a couple ways that I style a bob. Bob is a really popular haircut right now that I highly recommend. Not that I'm biased or anything, but I feel like a lot of reasons that people don't get a bob is because they feel like they can only wear it one way or they're like gonna lose fun hairstyle. So I'm gonna show you just a few of my go-tos. Why I cut all of my hair off. First of all, all of my hair that you see most of the time is just extensions. I just have, you know, clip-in extensions that are I think 22 inches. And so yeah, my natural hair was about to here. I'm a natural brunette. I think I'm gonna include a photo. Yeah, natural brunette. And you know, just years and years and years of being so blonde just kind of makes it super damaged. And I was to the point where I was really insecure with how my hair looked when it was down without extensions. And I was just feeling really like attached to the extensions. And I don't know, I was just like not loving that. Also, I mentioned this on my Instagram. I'm just gonna mention it quickly here because I don't know if I'm ready to do a full video on it quite yet. I've recently been back in therapy for um, an eating disorder and it's, it's one that I've face truly my whole life. I, for the first time in a few months, have like really been feeling the benefits of that therapy and my recovery. And a lot of this haircut was kind of an emotional experience. I wanted to cut off kind of all of those horrible months where I was feeling really, really down. And I wanted to prove to myself that I can feel confident and happy not being tied to my long hair, if that makes sense. I love my hair like this and it makes me feel confident and it makes me feel good. And as part of my recovery right now, it just felt right. It felt like a form of self-care for me. Brush your self-care. It just felt like a, a form of self-care that I wanted to do. and. It was such a great decision and I do not regret it at all. I wanted to cut off all of that negative energy that I have been harboring within myself and I wanted to like reward myself for sticking with the therapy, sticking with my recovery. It's been super hard. And again, I'm not gonna go super into it just because there's a lot to go into and I genuinely don't think I'm strong enough to do that quite yet. So. On a lighter note, I am gonna show you how I style it, just a few fun little things, um, little quick hairstyles that I think are super cute with a bob. So the first little quick style is just, I'm gonna braid this front piece kind of back like this. So yeah, there you go. I just secured it with a little hair tie. It's kind of nice to get it, that little big chunk out of your face sometimes. If you want, you could do the other side. It's just kind of a quick way that I think is really cute. And you can still, obviously you have this bottom half of your hair that is still out and cute and you can see the cut, but it just kind of gets this out of your face. The next one is little space buns. I know I feel like I do space buns all the time, but I think with short hair, it is extra cute. So here we go. There you go, just some little space buns. I think these are so cute. And again, it's kind of like with a bob haircut, you just have to realize that you're not going to be using much of the bottom half of your hair because it's so short. Look at how like short it is right here. So you just kind of have to realize that you're working with like the top half of your hair and anything that you're used to doing, you can still do. You're just, it's gonna be just like the top half version. Kind of like a little bit wavy now from the space buns, but anyways. If you want more tutorials on like how to style, like how to actually use like 
hot tools on it, let me know. If you have any questions on like the actual cut itself, I can like text my hair gal and you know, maybe I can figure out what the actual like order is. Overall, thank you so much for all of your support. I mean, it's crazy that I have so much support for like a haircut, but like it made me feel so good that everybody was like, yes, like that's such a big move. We're excited for you. And I'm like, that means a lot to me. It honestly does. No matter what any girl says, cutting off all your hair is a big deal. So it was nice to just feel really like loved and supported on cutting my hair. <laughs> but also the love and support on my Instagram post about me going to therapy again and um, kind of like opening up about this time in my life where I'm in eating disorder recovery, which is so crazy to even like say out loud because I could not even say those words a month ago. Your love and support there has meant the absolute world to me and it's encouraging me to stick with recovery it's encouraging me to push myself more and it's encouraging me that amazing times are possible ahead of me and honestly it's making me feel really proud of myself and i thank each and every one of you for that so go get some fresh air do some self care, cut your hair off, see what happens. But really, thank you so much again. And if you have any questions, comments, concerns on the bob, on the cut, on the styling, let me know. And I will see you soon. I hope you have a lovely week. I do wanna say if you are experiencing mental health issues where you feel like you are genuinely suffering from a mental illness, or feel you need to seek therapy in any way, I encourage you to do that. That was not the whole point of this video at all, but it is something that I wanna make very known that you deserve to feel happy, you deserve to feel good, and that takes work sometimes, a lot of the time. And it takes work in the form of therapy, it takes work in the form of medication, it takes work in ways that are different for everybody, and you deserve to feel your absolute best. Yeah, look into it if you are genuinely feeling the need. I strongly encourage you to do that because you deserve that. All right, I'm finally going. Thank you for watching and we'll see you soon. Bye.